Halloween is the one time of year where people come to your door looking to receive, and a number of believers take it as an opportunity to share the gospel, often handing out tracts with goodie bags. CBN News reporter Heather Sells joins us now to talk about her church's outreach program and to explain the origins behind the holiday Halloween. Thank you so much for being here, Heather. First off, how did Halloween originate? Right. So Halloween, or Hallow's Eve, originated in the ancient uh, cultic festival of Samhain, which means end of summer. And according to the Encyclopedia Britannica, the souls of the dead were supposed to revisit their homes. And many people believe that ghosts, witches, goblins, black cats, fairies, and demons roamed the earth. Wow. So how much money is, is spent during this holiday? Is it more than Christmas, perhaps? It's not more. <laughs> but I was shocked to find out that it does come in a close second. It is the second largest commercial holiday in America. It falls after Christmas, grossing $8 billion in sales. Christmas, of course, totals more than $700 billion off the charts. <laughs> All right, yeah. indeed. But second, wow. Yeah. When did the tradition of, of dressing up get started? Right, and that is a whole other area. Um, according to Live Science, the tradition of dressing in costumes and trick-or-treating may go back to the pra practice of mumming and goosing, in which people would disguise themselves and go door-to-door -door asking for food. Mm. Now, the holiday took a, a different turn when Christians arrived in Celtic nations. Tell us about All Souls Day. Yes, All Souls Day was a time when Christians would commemorate and pray for the souls of believers who had died in the Western Christian practice, they um, were celebrating in a prayer service on the evening of October 31st and ending November 2nd. And during this time, the poor would visit the houses of wealthier families to receive little pastries called soul cakes in exchange for a promise to pray for the family's dead relatives. Mm. And when did the tradition start here in the United States? Um, so really right after World War II uh, is when it started, and American kids um, before then were known to go out on Thanksgiving and ask mm. for food. Okay, on Thanksgiving. Now your church sees Halloween uh, as an opportunity to, to share the gospel. Tell me a little bit about why. Right, so it's interesting because when you think about it, Halloween is the only holiday that relies on the neighborhood. You really, it's a neighborhood holiday. You can't do it without the neighborhood. And so it is a time to connect with neighbors um, from that perspective. Um, and so our church this year, it's a Southern Baptist Church, mm -hmm. and um, they're handing out blitz uh, kits to everyone in the congregation to give them some devotions and ideas heading into Halloween as to how they can uh, be a witness for Christ and be salt and light. That's a great idea. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Heather, so much. You're welcome.